Hello everyone, I am Aditya here. Welcome to Jets of Tech. And in this session, we are going to discuss about uh, a simple overview for on BDP platform. Uh, the SAP BDP is the foundation of the intelligent sustainable enterprise. And if you see here, the business technology platform happens to be the base for all the latest developments that SAP is introducing into the into the uh, solutions of industries. Now here, if we look at the application development, integration, data analytics, and artificial intelligence. These all come under the business technology platform where like we have we can create our personalized experiences that instantly work with the SAP applications, builds faster with the business content and uh, to meet a change with agility, run with confidence on a trusted enterprise grade uh, platform. Now coming to the enterprise resource management, spend management, human capital management, customer relationship management and mo many more uh, such uh, solutions are all based on this business technology platform wherein we can have the business network, industry cloud, experience management, planning, this all happens to be part of it. Now, the, on the topmost of it, we have the business process management where we have the industry specific end-to-end -end process like we have R2R, OTP, B2B, these all are the different business process management solutions that we have here. So, intelligent sustainable enterprise is the, is the, is the vision of uh, providing uh, providing an industry with a uh, intelligent sustainable enterprise this is what is the basic uh, fundamental concept for introducing btp now the sap btp cloud capabilities we have uh, sap business technology platform where we have the app development integration data analytics and artificial intelligence when it comes to the app development we have the process automation digital experience visual low code um, uh, no code programming and DevOps. So integration, we have the process integration, we have a lot of APIs, lead integration, event-based integrations, we have data integrations and data analytics, we have the database, data management, data warehouse, the, uh, analytics and planning. And in artificial intelligence, we have the pre-built AI models, we have intelligent uh, processes, self-learning programs and uh, data security and uh, decentralized pre persistence. Uh, secure and uh, compliant, uh, open and uh, flexible, unified and simple. So we have got this broad ecosystem, enterprise grade and uh, scalable business network. We have this all under the business technology platform cloud capabilities. Basically the BTP services uh, takes care of all the application development, integration, data analytics and artificial intelligence. Going forward, BTP platform is 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 going to be the fundamental core of all the all the solutions that SAP is providing. Now, uh, most of you might be already aware of the basic BDP platform and how to log in. Uh, I've already uh, made some videos on uh, how to create your uh, trail version and uh, start using the BDP platform online. And then we have this enterprise readiness with holistic uh, life, life cycle management with sub items. Um, and in this we have the change in deployment management, technical uh, Open, uh, operations automation, altering, smooth integration, option into existing ALM processes, these all things are. Then on the on the bottom line, the the, it, and the BTP can be placed on any of the uh, cloud uh, cloud server like Microsoft Azure or Amazon Web Services or Google Cloud Platform or Alibaba Cloud or SAP, SAP's own cloud platform as well. Now in this like uh, we have got this all uh, various options where we can add to the app development like we have a city app uh, guider and uh, business application studio, we have work zone, we have SAP launchpad, SAP mobile services, SAP process automation, SAP task center and SAP graph as well. And I am going to talk about all these things in detail in uh, next coming sessions and uh, if at all if you would like to join the course on this SAP BTP platform, uh, like, uh, we can you can contact us on the mail id given in the description so integration we have the sap api business hub and then we have the sap integration suite where we have the cloud platform integration cpi and then we have this you know open content connectors and integration as assessments then we have this uh, sap management integration master integration event mesh and the internet of things coming to data analytics we all we already have a lot of things in place like business intelligence was already there Augmented analytics and enterprise planning was introduced. Then we have the data warehouse cloud, data data intelligence cloud. Then we have the master data governance and SAP HANA cloud. In artificial intelligence, we have the conversational AI, AI core, AI launchpad, and AI business services. 
Now, this is the improving the quick hire process with SAP Business Technology Platform, wherein we have this uh, application logic in a bag, Node.js, Python, or any other language. So this is it. Like um, we have got this uh, regret to retire option here. Uh, we are discussing about the business technology platform. What all can be done in this uh, entire uh, BTP? And then we have uh, manual or external third parties also can be involved in it. And then we have this uh, Cisco HANA applications as well, which can actually uh, go ahead and um, you know connect with this entire platform. Then we have this. Uh, if if we take now here, I'm taking the example of retreat to retire. On the on the interface level, we have the select job required to apply. That's that's how it starts. Then we have check if the applicant exists in the in the system. Uh, Esco Hana, uh, the uh, success factors, and then we have the approval review rejects or approves. If if it is if it is approved, then going to the address check, third party drug drink, and uh, then we have the background rejects. And all approved or rejected. So if it is approved, then notify the approver. Reject, notify the approver, and send offer if at all if it is approved. Then offer accepted and start onboarding. Then uh, an offer it is rejected. Update status across system. So this is something like recruit to retire process. We have still few more steps here. Uh, it's this is just an example of recruitment. But then we have till retirement we have a lot of other options being added here. I'm just taking an example. So this is actually a process. And this process is something which has been built on the PDP platform. Now there is a lot of flexibility to support your uh, transformation journey with SAP PDP. You can decide your optimal entry point. You have to uh, try before you buy. You can actually go for the free trial. We have got the free trial. I was discussing about the free trial option in in a couple of other videos. You can check that. Then we have the pay as you go. So you can just uh, go for zero commitment, and then you can just uh, kind of a subscription based uh, you know uh, usage that we can do and we have the CPEA wherein like uh, we have to uh, commit to consume then we'll be using we'll be telling to telling that uh, at least we'll have these many people who will be logged in or th these many users will be there we have the single service subscription wherein like we integrate and extend solutions at scale with individual SAP BTP services mixed as a mix make, making a fixed commitment to most favorable terms. So these are the various options that we have for our offerings as an offering for the clients. That's it and this was a very short uh, session on SAP BTP platform. Uh, I'm going to come up with more uh, information about SAP BTP because this is an extremely important concept for everyone working on the SAP platform. Thank you. Have a great day. And please do not forget to subscribe to our channel and also like and share this video. Hugs.